Using the laws of logarithms, you will find this on page 198 in the Namibia Ordinary Level Mathematics Textbook Y equals NX plus C to success. Using the laws of logarithms, logarithmic laws can be used to simplify expressions or to separate expressions. Let's first look at simplifying logarithms. When you are asking to simplify a log expression, this usually means you are given lots of log terms, each containing a simple argument, and you need to combine everything into one log with a complicated argument. So let's look at an example. Write as a single logarithm. Now, in this case, all the ones that's plus, okay, let's start first. If you see there's the power law, first jump up. Okay, so first do the power law. Then all the ones, can I show you here? All the ones that's positive, this one and this one, you multiply and this is subtract. Okay, and then you divide that one and that's how you do it. Okay, I want you to stop the video and I want you to do, try now 24, I want you to do number A as well as number D. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Let's start with number A. So log 3 plus log 4. This is the easy one. So this will just be log and it's multiplied. So it's 3 times 4. I think I'm not even, I'm just going to make it directly log of 12. Okay. Let's go on. Number D, 2 log 3 plus 3 log 2. So this is going to be log 3 to the power of 2 plus log 2 to the power of 3. So this is going to be actually log, 3 times 3 is 9. Um, okay, let's just log 9, multiply that log 8, and that will give you an answer of log 72. That's your answer. Okay, let's go on. Now, if I give you one like this, so write as a single logarithm. Now, there is no log word, so I must first create a log word here. Now, because in ordinary level, all the base is 10, it's actually very easy. That's because 10 to the power 3 will just be 1,000. So it will just be log 1,000. So first I must write log 1,000. And so then I have two log words. You know, see, log, log. And now I can divide it and I can finalize my answer. Now, I, want to, I will show you the method of doing it. But because it's just base of 10, it's actually very easy. 1 will be log 10, 2 will be log 100, 3 will be log 1000, 4 will be log 10,000. So there's 1 zero, 2 zeros, 3 zeros, 4 zeros. But if you, I want to show you the method that if, if the base was not 10, it is actually just saying, okay, so in this case it will just be, um, say, 10 to the power what? is equal to 3 and then just write it in log form from exponent to log so it's log keep the 10 and then I'm just going to swap that to okay let's just see 10 to the power okay let's just I want to just see if I can find you that so it's 10 to the power no no let's just correct that I'll show you again I'm going to correct it so it's log 10 and I want that value and that must give me an answer of 3. And then it will be from log to exponent. So it will be 10 to the power 3 equals a. And that's 10 times 10 times 10, which will be a. So a will be a thousand. So there I will put the thousand, and that's what I got there. Okay, but in ordinary level, you can just remember it like this. As soon as we come to the next level, uh, AS level, then, then we will go deeper into the method. 
So, in this case, there is no lock law for, for this nor for this. Okay. So, I want you to stop the video again and I want you just to do number A and I want you to do number B. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's just move this up. So let's start with number A. So it's log 5 plus 1. So now in this case, it's very easy. And I'm just going to show, that will just be log 10. Okay. Um, I, I want to show you the other method again. Because, um, so it will actually just be, I'm looking for what, there to write so that it's equal 1. So I go from log form to index, so 10 to the power 1 equals a, so a is equal to 10. So I can just substitute the 10 there, which I did there. If it stands nothing, remember the base will always be 10. And that will then give me an answer of log 5 times 10, which will give me log 50. Okay, then number b, so 2 plus 2 log A minus 3 log B. So in this case, I'm not going to show you, so I just know it's 100 plus jump up. So it's log 8, 2 minus log B, 3. So the plus 2, I'm going to, I'm going to multiply. So it's log. 100 a squared minus log b3 and that's going to be log 100 a squared over b3. Always the ones that subtract I just write under because that's going to indicate division and that's how you do it. Okay, let's move on to the next example, 26. So in this example, if I say write as a single, it's a bit more complicated, but just jump up. That's what I did there. I can take it out of the root. So there's the 2 and there's the 5, and then I jump up there. Then I can just simplify this and get this. Uh, and now I'm just going to this 2, that the ones that's positive. Can I show you again here? The ones that's positive, positive. I'm going to multiply. That's what I did there, 5, 2. And this is 2 to the power 4, and that I subtract. And then I just divide, and then I write my final. Then I simplify, and I get log 2, which is 2. Okay, but it's the same, maybe just a bit more complicated. Again, I want you to stop the video, and I want you to do, try now 26. I want you to do number A. And I want you to do, okay, let's do E. Let's do a, a little bit more complicated. Okay, so let's start with number A. So it's log 8 plus log 1, 2, 5. Okay, so this is easy. So it's just going to be log 8 multiply 1, 2, 5, which is going to give me an answer of log 1,000. And that final answer will just be 3. Okay. And then I'm going to just do number E. So this will be log 16 plus 15 log 5, 3 minus 2 log 2 minus log one, two, five. Okay, so this is going to then be um, log 16, leave it like this. This one will be, okay, now if I'm writing this one and just look, it's going to be five because this stands a one. So it's going to be one over three, and then I'm going to multiply this one still with that 15. It's a little bit complicated. I'll show you now. So leave it first like that. I just want to get that two correct. Two, two, 
minus log 1 to 5. So this will be log 16 plus, now this is 15 divided 3, so it will be log 5 to the power of 5 minus log um, 4, doesn't matter, I can write it like this also, minus log 1 to 5. Okay, now where's the ones that's addition? Let's just quickly... So the positive ones, this is positive, this is positive, this is negative. The positive ones, this is just a method, I write on top. So it will be log uh, 16 multiply 5 times to the power of 5 will be 1 to 5. Okay. Okay, so, so 5 to the power of 5 or 1 to 5. Now, 5 to the power of 5, 5 to the power of 3 is 1 to 5. This is a bit bigger. That's 3, 1, 2, 5. 5 to the power of 3 is 1 to 5. And then the ones that I put at the bottom. So it's 4, but I multiply. Because if I put, if I put a bracket there, can I show you? It's going to, that will become a positive. But I'm not going to do that. I just, all the subtraction ones I write at the bottom. So that will give me an answer of log, so multiply that 16, it's 50,000, 50,000 and divide by that 500 and that will give me log Okay, one, two, that will give me a hundred. The final answer will be two. And that's how I do it. In the next video, we will look at expand and separate logarithms.